A lot of people think that holiday cooking is complicated and risotto is impossible. I'm here to tell you it's not. It's easy when you do it in a Bradley smoker and absolutely tasty. So let's head down to the smoker. Risotto. And yes, I did say risotto out of a smoker. You can do it. It's really, really simple. So the first thing is, I take some fresh rosemary. Just a little bit. You don't need a lot. Rosemary is quite powerful. So we just take a little bit of rosemary, just tear it up on your fingers, and then you pour it onto a smoker rack. We're going to take this over. We're going to pop it into the smoker. We're doing a tomato, sweet pepper, and hot chili pepper, onion, and garlic risotto. So first things first, we're going to take the onions. And you don't even need to peel them. You just want to cut them into little wedges like that. You're going to line them up on your smoker rack. And you take your garlic. You've got lots of cloves of garlic. Next, sweet red shepherd peppers. Hot peppers. They can go along this side, just like that. Stack them up. And then tomatoes. I like to cut them into wedges. Then you take a little bit of salt. Nice. And then down here on your onions. Get under in between on those ones, unbelievable. Now, let's head into the smoker. Slide them in on the bottom. Now, temperature, I'm just gonna crank it up to medium high a little bit. We got enough biscuits. And when you when the, the rice is smoking, just you can see in here, look at that rice there. Look there. And all you're gonna do is take your fingers as it smokes and sort of move it about so that you get a nice even layer on the rice all the way around. And then we close our door. Now it's cocktail time. Let things smoke. And when that all gets nice and smoky and done, we're going to make our risotto. All right, our Boreo rice, the garlic, look at in here. Look at that. The garlic, it's nice and, and soft. Our sweet peppers, smoke roasted. And right in here, we've got some of our hot chilies. So this is all ready to come out. After our Boreo rice is smoked, what you want to do is you want to cool it and then put it into a jar. This is just like a mason jar. Seal it tight, put it in the cupboard, and it's going to intensify, but at least 24 hours before you go and use it. And then when you open it up, oh, that sweet, smoky goodness, your rice is ready to make risotto. So we peeled all our peppers. We started to chop them up. These are the hot peppers. You want to make them a little bit smaller than the sweet shepherd's peppers that were smoke roasted. We're just coarsely chopping them. And what's great is you can smoke this days ahead. You don't have to smoke it and rush around. You can smoke it, smoke your rice, get that stuff all ready, and then you make risotto. We're all set to rumble. We're gonna take a little bit of olive oil that olive oil moving all around this pan. One part rice, four parts liquid. And so this is our smoked arborio rice. Back. Take a sniff. Smell that. It smells good. Put it in. You don't have to toast it a lot because it's already got a bit of color on it from the smoke, but just a little. We're going to add in our smoked garlic. We've added the garlic, we're gonna add a little bit of wine. Oh yeah. Let that sizzle up, give it a little stir. Now we're gonna add a little bit of chicken stock. And you're gonna add it a little bit at a time. And in this pan, we're gonna have to turn things down now so that we don't evaporate all of that. And you wanna constantly stir it. There you go, constantly stir it. We're just gonna add a little bit more. Get some chicken stock there. The more you stir, the more starch you get out of it, but you can extract too much starch, and then you have a risotto that's kind of lumpy and clumpy, and you don't want that. You want it to be smooth. It's all about patience when it comes to risotto. It's just like smoking. 
Only your arm gets tired because you got to stir. Now we're going to take all of this goodness. Look, we're just going to dump that just like that in. Now, just stir it in. Oh, it's going to be spicy, tomatoey, smoky. And then white wine, just a touch. Pinch of salt and pepper, like that. This is my secret. This is mascarpone cheese. You start to stir that in, just like that. You stir that in, and it's gonna get creamy. Yeah, baby. Some rosemary. Just break it up, tear it up, put it in. That's it. Oh, stir it. Maybe, okay, I'm gonna shut the heat off now. We got enough heat in there. There you go. Little Parmesan cheese. Just strips of that. And I tell you, that. It's risotto heaven. Oh, yeah. There we go. Now, take a little squeeze of that grilled lemon. Maybe we'll just sprinkle that like that. And then just a little bit, just a few more strips of Parmesan right over top like that. This is some tasty eating. Now, most people think when it comes to smoking food, it's about ribs and brisket, pulled pork and chicken. But you can do anything in your smoker. You can smoke the rice, the, ar the arborio rice. You can smoke the tomatoes, the peppers, the onions, the garlic. You can smoke virtually anything you want in there. And then create those dishes that you love and add a little smoky flavor to it. But I would say it's smoky goodness. Right here is a side dish. Your holiday entertaining will be fantastic.